Hi, Galaxy 2. I'm playing it. And I have Walter with me, because we're doing all the prankster comments. And Check I, it out, because I'm not a have... hilarious prankster. Yeah, I love that they're called prankster comments. Yeah, I mean, this looks like a prank to me, right? Because they're mocking you. Yeah, you fucking idiot. Yeah, it's a prank <laughs> because you're like, oh wait, I've already done all this shit before. Yeah, and they prank you into doing it again. Yeah, <laughs> that's why they're <laughs> prankster comments, because it's just the game pranking you into playing the same game again. What do you uh, have to do for this prankster comment? Hit all of the guys with your rainbow head. Uh, that seems um, tough, there's a lot of them. I did really shitty at this uh, several times. I'm only showing my successful attempts at these things. But yeah, the first couple of tries, I like didn't know where they all were because some of these some of these guys like hide in little corners. And, yeah, that's how they get you, right? Also, I believe this rainbow star will continue being there for as long as it takes you to get the star. I want to try that out now. <laughs> why didn't you include it in the video for all of our, us curious pranksters? Yeah, why didn't I run around for 30 seconds? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what the hell's your problem? In this already half hour long video. Yeah, I've been here for half an hour. I thought this was going to be 20 minutes. I got places to be, man. Oh, sorry. Call it off. <laughs> Video's cancelled. Cut, cut the video. <laughs> Start playing something else, fuckface. Just the rest of the video has no commentary. <laughs> It'd be um, like, oh, well, that was Walter. I guess the rest is just gonna be on my own. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm doing... Dick. I'm Yeah, I'm doing the uh, videos a little bit longer. I usually try to keep these between 20 and 25 minutes, but because it's... I'm just trying to, like, bang out as many of these stars as I can, so... and yeah. not have it be, like, 15 videos of doing these and the green stars, which is gonna be even more. Um, so... You know, just to... quicken it's things up. And also, oh, time on. flies a little bit more when you are when you have a co-commentator, you can yeah. shoot the shit and whatnot. Yeah, we can give each other high fives through Discord, I'll slap my monitor and have to buy a new one. I, I just actually hit my monitors if anybody would be able to see the joke. I hope nobody <laughs> noticed the epic edit and figures out that I died the first time. I was too I busy this. slapping my monitor, so I didn't notice. Nice. It's really strange to me that you're, like, I've only played this game for two hours in, like, my entire life, and you're doing the stars that, like, I've actually seen before. Oh, yeah, because it's the beginning of the yeah. game. Yeah. But now I'm doing the epic gamer master versions of them. Where oh you yeah, don't get one hit. hit point. Yeah, that's what happened. I only died once, and you can see. Well, the people watching can't see, but Walter can see because I'm sharing Premiere on my screen. Smile. Uh, there's a long stretch of no editing here. I actually um, can't because... see that. <laughs> oh, well, I only fuck. see the game. Oh. Way to lie to your viewers, Tim. Well, shit. I thought you could see my whole Premiere window. I was able to see it before. Did you, like, put in full screen or something? I didn't do shit. I guess Dis Discord does yeah, that? Yeah, Discord does that for some programs. It's pretty all nifty. Right. I mean, that's fine. That's all you really need to see. Well, anyway, I was yeah, only saying matter. that to brag about the fact that after failing at those first two, I managed to get through the next several with no problems and do all of them fairly quickly to the point that I didn't feel the need to edit out any of the middle bits hell so, yeah yeah i recorded this at like 2 a.m so i guess that's my, my most powerful gamer hour because <laughs> all the, the several videos before this where i was doing like the final bowser level and everything i was sucking mad dick 2 a.m is the real gamer hours yeah that's when your your third eye opens <laughs> Little slit your, starts cracking your across your forehead. Gamer chakra unlocks. Anyway, let's see what's next. I don't even really remember. Oof, uh, is it the flat? No, oh, that's not the flat. No, not yet. We will. I think we're doing that in this one. Because some of them haven't had the prankster comet show up yet, so I'm going to be going back. But otherwise, I'm doing them in order. Yeah, get ready to hear that a lot. You can oh, hear the game run. as well, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Discord sucks up the audio. 
All right, so do you think that word is pronounced flotilla or flotilla? <laughs> You're asking me a really hard question here. So I thought that it was going to be like the peewee piranha, or uh, I guess, is it peewee piranha? Or whatever. I might have a different name because he's the egg one. It's like this I think game's it's version piranha. of it. Yeah, the 90th piranha, PD piranha shit. Um... I think it's Pee-wee Prana. Anyway, uh, I also that think one, it's Flotilla. The... I think it's probably Flotilla. I don't know. Who cares? Anyway, um, in that one, the speed run is you do the whole level and the boss battle, so I thought that's what this was going to be, and I was not excited to play through this fucking Bowser Jr. level again. But luckily, it's just uh, beating Gobblegut for like the fifth time. How are you even, like, speedrun this? It's not like there's really any speed strategy. You just wait for a next phase when you're actually able to, like, deal damage to him. Yeah, I, mean, I guess chose, it's like, just, the lowest like, stakes not things possible for doing them. a speedrun. Yeah. I guess just not doing what I did and missing the last one because I was getting my ass eaten. I like that he spits up a bunch of, uh, star bits that you can suck up, though. I like the noise he makes. It makes me think of trains. Wonder why. Yeah. I also like that he's a big train guy. I always, I really liked this uh, boss when I first played through this game. I thought Back it was alright when I first played it, like, eight months ago. <laughs> I played this uh, game the day it came out. I bought Ooh. it the day it came out. And I had a capture card, actually. Um, because my plan was to start an epic YouTube channel and LP this game. And you deprived us of your blind playthrough of Galaxy 2. Well, it's not my fault. It's because the capture card is a dazzle and it didn't fucking work. You should have pulled uh, yourself up by your bootstraps and purchased a new capture card with uh, 2 million tomatoes. I probably <laughs> needed a different computer too because I was using my mom's netbook. Oh no. I like this was in 2010. That. This was when uh, this was the early days of you and I knowing each other. It was back in the day. Yeah, Jesus Christ. This game actually came out like right around the time that we met each other because it came out in late May of 2010. Hmm. And uh, you, you and I first talked when you started the IRC, which was in May of 2010. Yeah. So pretty much at the same time. Yeah. So yeah, the, my my LP dreams started there, and look at me now. Yeah, and now it's coming full circle, and now that we've done this, we'll die. And it only <laughs> took me 11 years to do it. <laughs> oh no, I haven't seen this level. This looks pretty nifty. We're it's gonna be eating some peppers. Cool. We will be eating some hot, spicy peppers. Um... And, uh, you'll, it's a speedrun, so you get to see the level really fast, so you don't have to see all the, like, bullshit and me being bad at it like you would yeah, have. Yeah, <laughs> like right now when, when I you first failed did to it. eat the pepper. Hey, you know what? You idiot. Sometimes... You just hold the button. You sometimes your pointer <laughs> isn't pointing. Yeah. I have yeah, to sit in a... Yeah, so you're pointing some, like, actual Wii, right? <laughs> yeah. I have to sit in a kind of weird position to, like, get the Wii mote to point and, like, be on the screen properly. I have to, like, because my my couch is just, like, a little bit too low for, like, where the sensor bar is. Yeah, and, like, it. I have to, like, prop my arm up, the arm that has the Wii mote in it, on my leg. Mm. Because holding my arm up and forward for, like, two hours while I record this game hurts. <laughs> I've had the same thing with my Wii, because, uh, like, I bought a new Wii, like, a year ago or something. Obviously not new, but, you know? Yeah. And, and yeah, I have, like, this little tiny, like, 12-inch CRT on my desk, and, like, just getting the sensor bar in a position where it actually works is, like, a huge pain in the ass. I can imagine. Yeah. We really put up with a lot of shit in, like, 2006. Wow, us gamers. Is that when the Wii came out? Uh, yeah. That's fucked up. <laughs> it yeah. feels like it's such a modern console. Yeah, it does. I mean, they made games for it for a pretty long time. Uh, I believe... 
I know that up until at least like 2018 or 2019, they were still releasing games for the Wii, albeit it was like three of them, and it was all like Wii Fit spinoffs made specifically for like nursing homes. Yeah, we'll have just all been like shovelware for. for oh, like... and Just Dance. Oh yeah, I think they they probably still have Just Dance games coming out for like the PSP. It's kind of neat though that like the pieces of technology become so ubiquitous just because I guess how many they produced with like how high the demand was initially that they oh, end yeah. up having fucking Wii's like everywhere, so they're just still producing software for them. I won't be surprised yeah. if there are still Wii titles coming out. Yeah. Yeah, it is neat. And I mean, I think it's the, the same Wii with the PS2, the... wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, the PS... Yeah, the PS2 had, like, you know, maybe not AAA games, but, like, you know, games by oh, yeah. studios no, coming out for until, like, like 2011. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, and I mean, even then, I mean, the PS2 came out in, what, 2000 or 2001? And, uh, they still had, like, major, uh, studio game releases for the PS2 in, like, 2008, which was two years after the PS3 came out, so. Jeez. Uh, yeah. I mean, in my opinion, the PS2 is probably the best console, all things considered. Um, certainly in terms of library, in my opinion, I think the number of, like, really good PS2 releases that are either PS2 exclusives or just the best version of the game, like, of the consoles it came out for at the time, is very high. Mm -hmm. uh, you're kind of close on this crab smashing. I, I did manage to get it, but yeah, I'm fucking freaking out right here. <laughs> yeah, right? Oh my fucking one second left. You're probably that rolling thing can be a little bit... It can be a little bit hard with uh, to control the rolling thing. You kind of just have to let it like take you in whatever direction you started in. Mm -hmm. Are you able to like cancel it, or do you just have to wait until Mario's done rolling? Yeah, no, you just have to wait till it ends, or you hit something. Oh god! <laughs> I thought that you could spin to end it, but no. You're just trapped in rolling rock ball. Rolling hell. crab or romp. Oh yeah, <laughs> rolling crabber romp is awesome. I love that they use crabber. Yeah, the fact that those enemies are called crabbers is pretty good, especially because there's a Pokemon called Crabber. Ooh. Oh, oh, we're, we're reading this. You put it in the yeah. video. That's part of the story that you want to it, present it's everybody. Not, it's not very important, but I didn't feel like cutting it. <laughs> it's like ten seconds. I thought it was gonna be a fucking one up. Every now and then you just want to see a nice save screen. I also like how, I guess this can be my reason for keeping it in, is that it's kind of funny that you get that letter every once in a while in the game, and it's Rosalina talking to the Luma, but it's anonymous because Rosalina is supposed to be a big reveal uh, at the end of the game, where it's like, you know, oh... The star mother is looking for her lost one. What could this mean? It's like, oh, maybe it's <laughs> the, the fucking lady from the first be? game. Yeah. Uh, yeah, maybe it's everyone's favorite anime space GF from the first Galaxy game. <laughs> um, <laughs> my favorite space mommy. Um, but uh, anyway, it's funny because I fucking beat Bowser and already saw Rosalina, and she technically took the Luma away and my hat, but I still have it somehow. Um, and, and but it, so it's just funny that she's still like sending correspondence, like I hope we can meet again. And it's like you're, t you took them. <laughs> just teasing Mario now. You took them away from me, and now I don't have a fucking hat. Hey Mario, wouldn't it be nice if you still had that Luma inside your skull? And I can't spin. Here's a one. That was shed. one thing that like I never got about the first Galaxy game, and I'm it's a thing in this game too, where like the spinning move. I remember at the E3 thing for the first Galaxy game, they were like, we needed an explanation for Mario's spinning ability, and I was like, no you fucking do you? don't. He <laughs> spins around. Yeah. Like, that's just a thing you can do in games. You don't need to be oh, oh, that makes perfect sense. A star goes in his hat, and that makes him spin. Like, oh, oh yeah. I'm. Thank you for clearing that up. That doesn't raise any new questions. What's the Luma physiology like? Why are you able to spin with a Luma on your hat? 
Yeah, both of them are like, both games are like, the Luma went into Mario's hat and Mario could feel himself filling with warmth and power. And it's like, <laughs> that's fucking weird. Are you sure it's just not, like, Mario can't just spin his hands around normally? <laughs> We'll try it. See how fast you go. I bet you can't get a second jump out of it. Probably not fast enough to uh, launch myself out of a star. Ooh. I almost got fucked. Oh, I love that, like, the fucking falling threat in this game is just black holes. Yeah, it's not just uh, gaps. It's you have you have to have your whole fucking body pulled yeah, apart. Yeah, like there's a singularity below you, and you're going to enter it if you fuck up. It would be awesome if they uh, tried to do like uh, if they did like a Galaxy Three on the Switch. They could probably do this effect that, like, is in the movie Interstellar, where they, you know, the way that light bends around a black hole when you're like looking at it oh yeah i don't know if if they did some crazy like image warping when you're near a black hole in this game and that like fucks up the game That'd be even more cool. that would be pretty cool like you can actually see the other side of a black hole or something yeah or like what's i mean on i the don't other side of it yeah i don't i don't have a big enough fucking space brain to be able to like verbalize what i'm thinking of but you know what i mean when, <laughs> we're when... just demanding some game have gravitational lensing be featured <laughs> in it yeah <laughs> <laughs> like this needs i mean to i'm happen. sure you could do it yeah you know all, all those uh, dudes who write on chalkboards all the time they figure out the numbers that you had to put in right yeah, you guys, you're so good with the fancy numbers. Make me some video games. They need so many chalkboards that they, like, put them on little sliders and everything so they can get another chalkboard when they fill one up. Oh, yeah, I love those. So they I must always, have some uh, shit. That's like, I always think about in movies and TV where it's like a school scene and there's a big chalkboard and they've filled up the entire chalkboard. It's like, that's kind of hard to do without, like, fucking up other parts of the chalkboard, you know? <laughs> yeah, I guess that's true, right? Because you gotta, like, lean on something to write on it. And also, just, like, it must be confusing for the students. They're like, Jesus, these notes are going crazy. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I've ever seen a chalkboard get nearly that full before everybody stopped paying attention in school. But then again, usually in those sorts of fictional scenarios, the class is, like, you know, advanced fuck- just advanced uh, yeah. fuck, uh, th and I never took that, so... Yeah. I'm not a fuckist. <laughs> I'm a fuckologist. <laughs> that, for some reason, reminds me of an, uh, uh, The Oatmeal comic, uh, where he's talking about... It's just, like, a list of complaints he has with web design things, which are all outdated now and even worse. Um... Oh but, uh... <laughs> uh... I just, a thing that I think about all the time from that comic is um, he doesn't like when the United States isn't the first in the drop-down list of countries when you're making an oh account. God. And he and he says, I don't want to have to scroll past shit fuckistan. It feels like it's weird to complain about, but that bugs the shit on me too. Like, I have to set up iPads at work a lot. And on the iPads, occasionally they'll actually put uh, the United States at the top. I don't know what the difference is. Like, sometimes it's just up there, but most of the time you have to scroll all the way to the bottom of the country list. And it's like, where are most of these iPads being set up? I can assure you they're probably not largely being set up in Azerbaijan. Yeah, and I mean, it comes in English by default, so like, it's, I don't know. I guess, I mean, th even the comic offers the caveat like yes i know this is you know america centric or whatever but fuck it you know yeah like you'd think apple would want to cater to their customers with like whatever countries that the ipads are most commonly purchased in or whatever i don't fucking know. and like in your scenario where it's your job like where you're setting up a lot of them in a row it's just kind of like extra time consuming yeah you gotta fucking scroll all the way down Here's a really nice, simple, and easy oh, comment where you just suck up all the purple coins. Yeah, I love this. I wish all of the fucking prankster yeah, comments were this. For any purple coin comments, they should just have a hundred of them like right in front of you at the beginning. Yeah, that'd be great. I don't even mind the sh the 
cosmic clones. I keep calling them Shadow Marios. It's basically what they are, but... Uh, I Yeah, I've never really had an issue with these guys in this game. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's kind of like just move at all, and they're not really a threat. Yeah. Especially, and don't they, like, just damage you once? It's not like they kill you if you touch them or something. Yeah, you you have to be, like, kind of, yeah. Shit it's almost like anyway. this is a shitty baby game. And then you get to suck up all these star bits, which I love. Yeah. It's my favorite, one of my favorite parts of the game is just slurping up all the Put that star mode into action. Bitches. Yeah. Uh, I, something we were just talking about made me think of something else that I wanted to say and now I completely forget, so. It happens to me multiple times per day. Yeah. I mean, that happens to me multiple times per video. People who watch my LP videos will know that. Ooh. I'll, I'll do oh, like 40%. We're going to flat fuck galaxy. Yeah, we're doing, we're, we're doing flip flop. I thought I had more of a joke, but flip -flop. I don't. I mean, that's a pretty good joke. You ever yeah, flip flop? So. That's kind of a crazy word. Um, I thought you were going to miss it for a second. No, I just wanted to get those boys, you know. <laughs> but yeah, people who watch my LP videos will know that I'll very often, like, say 40% of a thought, and then something will happen in the game, and I'll be like, ah, oh, Mario is fat. And then yeah, I'll be like, ah, oh, shit, what was I saying? <laughs> yep. Completely gone from my brain. I'm, I'm curious about, like, the hiding spots they're gonna choose for purple coins here. They're gonna put them in annoying places. Really. They're gonna make you flip everything. You wanna see an epic death? Uh, yes. Well, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now, where's the uh, fucking black hole there, huh? How did Mario die? He will have just yeah, kept going. Yeah, he's just falling. Clearly the oxygen isn't the problem, because he's just still alive right now. That would be crazy I didn't if... know you could grab the side of those. <laughs> Neither did I, but I'm extremely glad that he did. <laughs> yeah, um, otherwise you would have had to do that, like, four seconds of gameplay again. It would be great, and by then I mean very bad, if wherever there's not a um, black hole in this game and you fall, it just, like, you just get pulled into another galaxy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Like, you just fall into the last galaxy or something. You have to wait, like, 45,000 years before you encounter another galaxy or something. Yeah. I think a third galaxy game on the Switch could be pretty cool. I'd certainly play it. I would. I, I kind of don't expect them to actually do that, but it'd be neat. <laughs> no. I guess also because you don't have the pointer anymore, and the whole motion... I mean, I... If I can help it, I, like, never use the motion controls on the Switch. Yeah, the, uh, the pointer on the screen is not the main feature of the game, really. Yeah. I'm taking a pretty cautious approach to this, uh, purple coin, because I just don't want it, to... It's a lot of... It's a lot of flipping. It's a lot of flip Yeah, flip there's a hundred coins. You have to pick up every last one of them, right? Yeah. No, I think they fudged it a little bit. <laughs> oh, if time, oh, yeah, so if you, time yeah. runs out and you have 98, they're like, ah, close enough. <laughs> hey, you put in the that, old college try, huh? That would be the game that I would make for myself to play. I'd be like, oh, you didn't win? Eh, fuck it. <laughs> Actually, you do win. It's fine. Yeah. I like this song. I was just gonna say the same thing. It's pretty jazzy. It's not jazzy, but, you know. Are you sure? Cool. I don't know what jazz is. I mean, of course, like, all the galaxy music is pretty fantastic in general. Yeah, galaxy music is great. Have uh, you ever heard the Gusted Garden song? That one's pretty No! Cool. How's it go? I can't. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> Oh, All no, right. I'm thinking of this song because I'm go. listening to it right now. <laughs> I think this is that, right? Oh, it might be the epic version of it. Well, yeah, it's got the the beat under it. Yeah, and like the black shadows in the corners of the screen. It's which got is the epic beat. not part of the song whatsoever. <laughs> yeah. 
hey, All maybe right, well, we uh, struggle through that one. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, my game, my time on that was pretty long. It took me a few tries to get that one. Hey, look, more purple coins. We're gonna go do Ooh, that. Tall now. trunk. Yeah. This reminds me that I stopped playing Odyssey and haven't played in like a year. I was just about to mention Mario Odyssey. I do plan on LPing that at some point. I plan on LPing all the 3D console Mario games. I was uh, sm I was jumping on Lubba's head because he dared suggest that I take a break. Oh, is that um, what he said? I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, he was like, oh, you look tired. I always look tired. What's your point? <laughs> I am tired, Lubba. I'm tired of your bullshit. Oh, that was an epic one right there. Yeah, I fucking got him. Um, But yeah, I do... I want to do all the 3D console Mario games at some point, and I have said that I'm going to 100% all of them, but Mario Odyssey has so much shit mm -hmm. that you have to get. And I really, at some point, I think it would stop being interesting to watch. It's just um, kind of like you do as much as you want to, and then you stop playing the game. Yeah, I do think I'm going to end up just coming up with some arbitrary cutoff point. Yeah, um, it's a little awkward. Ooh, nice little fade there, huh? You yeah, I... I, uh, so, I didn't know this when I was first going through it. I didn't remember this, but there's more than 100 coins on here. You just have to get 100 um, but I was freaking out. I was like, do I have to go through this twice? Because I was like, <laughs> there are some coins that I definitely can't get at the same time. And I was missing a bunch. As you can see, I'm steadfastly uh, yeah, avoiding like, all of them. <laughs> you try to get all of them by fucking going in the middle. <laughs> it's like, um, maybe if I'm close enough to him, we'll just give me both. So, Odyssey kicks ass, yeah. though. Yeah, like, Odyssey's that, great. Be a, that'd be a watcher. I definitely want to LP it because just the main game is great. Uh, Ooh. That was very close. Oh my close. fucking god, you barely made that gap. Yeah, I was freaking out. I think I I get just a hundred, I think. Yeah, right? Yep. Oh my god. I was literally, I was like, if I get 99 and get to the end, I'm going to kill my... Because you die if you don't fucking get it. You, like, you just go happens? up to this... Like, this little robot you go up to Guillermo so and, and he goes, oh, you only got 92. Uh, try again <laughs> next time. And then Mario dead. just falls over and dies. Which is really funny. It's like the uh, Il Piantissimo race... Uh, shines in mario sunshine if you lose those which you really have to be like not awake to do <laughs> um uh yeah you'll get to il piantissimo at the end and he'll be like hey, hey i have beaten you and mario will just hold his head and die <laughs> I'd be and i feel like that sometimes i mean yeah i mean he's fucking small and not even that fast I'd probably die in real life if I lost a race to Koopa the Quick, who really has an unearned nickname. No, Master all you gotta P. do is, you just gotta do a backwards BJ, <laughs> which is what Bobby calls a backwards <laughs> long jump. Which I, <laughs> for a long time, they're called BLJs, right? Yeah. Uh, backwards long jump. You're right. Um, when, <laughs> when I was uh, younger, I kept calling them LBJs. Uh-oh. Which is, uh, that is a president. That is not a Mario 64 <laughs> move. Where's the thing in Mario 64 speed running LBLJ? Is that a, a long bob long jump? Oh, it's just like a particular <laughs> BLJ. It's a lobby BLJ. Yeah. Yeah, backwards BJ. Yeah. Uh, this star is fucking annoying. Oh yeah, uh, it's the funny ball star, so. Yeah, I hate all the shit where you use the Wiimote in ways I don't like. I don't like this, I don't like the flying ones. Uh, they're, they're butt. I don't like those. I played through um, Galaxy 1 and Dolphin, and I had the, um, like, Wemo accelerometer just mapped to the directional buttons on the fucking Xbox controller. And it made so shit this like probably this so much pretty goddamn easy. easier. I can imagine. Yeah. 
It's yeah, same it's, thing with, it's, like, the uh, manta ray surfing and shit. Oh, yeah. It's oh, all just shit. completely trivial. Oh, God, I'm glad there's none of that in this fucking game. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> I completely forgot about that. Uh, I remember being 12 and spending many minutes on those fucking stars. My... I don't know if I've ever beaten that one, because on my one file of Mario Galaxy 1 that I beat the game on, I think I had my brother play that for me. <laughs> I was oh, like, God. I can't do it. I love that. My instance of getting people play games for me is, um, when I was, like, eight playing Zelda Oracle Seasons, I always get my mom to do the, uh, boomerang minigame in Sabrosia, where you have to dance and, like, press the buttons with rhythm. Couldn't uh, do it. I can't even imagine asking my mom to play a game for me. Fortunately, my mom was a gamer in her heyday, so it was okay. <laughs> That's pretty epic. Yeah, isn't it? That was epic, too. You got the star. I uh, yeah. You're restoring power to your head. To my Ship. face, yeah. <laughs> Alright, we got a pretty good little number of stars now. Yeah, was it 93? Yeah. It's crazy how that... Beat. And now the video is ending. Bye.